Hallo und herzlich willkommen hier zu einer neuen Folge von Life is Strange auf dem Konfi-Kanal. Ich habe mir mal erlaubt, die Treppe schon mal hochzugehen, dass wir hier starten können. Und wir schauen uns mal wieder ein bisschen um. Unser Hauptziel ist es ja, wie gesagt, ins Badezimmer zu gehen und dort die Morphin... Morphin... Ich habe jetzt gerade eine Stunde nicht aufgenommen, eine Morphin-Injektion Um Chloe bei ihren Kopfschmerzen zu helfen. Wo geht's denn hier rein? Ah, das sieht aus wie das Elternschlafzimmer. Oh, Max, it is so nice to have you around. Look at them. They have no idea what's in their future. San Francisco Holidays with William and Chloe. Da war noch zu der Zeit war noch alles gut. William is trying so hard. He's still awesome. Super Dad, be the family hero. Stört ihr halt auch überhaupt nicht, dass wir in ihr Schlafzimmer einfach reinkommen und hier ihre Kommoden durchsuchen. That is such a sweet shot of Chloe. I wonder who took the picture. Die junge Chloe. Noch vor ihrem Unfall. Oh no. I didn't realize how bad Chloe's injury really was. Dear Mr. and Mrs. Price, as we discussed last week, Chloe's res respiratory system is showing signs of rapid weakening. Uh, weakening, not weakening, weakening. This accounts for her recent enema and loss of breath. As a doctor, I am committed to her well-being, but I want you to understand the reality that respiratory failure is common in people with severe, severe spinal injuries. Ich glaube, das ist alles ein bisschen mit den Fachbegriffen auf Englisch kenne ich mich nicht aus, aber es geht alles ein bisschen in die Wirbelsäulen Richtung, glaube ich. Your daughter is one of the bravest, strongest patients I've ever had and I am proud to be working with her. I just want you as parents to prepare for any and all possibility. I believe Chloe should also be made aware of a changing condition. If you would like to discuss this further, you may. You have my contact information. Best, Dr. Anton Phelps. Uh, this accounts for a reason. Okay, die hatte ja irgendwas mit der Wirbelsäule ist im Arsch bei Chloe. Das erklärt auch recent anemia, also ich glaube Gedächtnisverlust müsste das sein und loss of breath, also dass sie nicht mehr selbstständig atmen kann. So, Joyce, immer schön eine rauchen hier. Hm. Joyce used to hate smokers in the diner. Okay, also in dieser Alternativwelt ist sie dann auch selbst zum Raucher geworden. Joyce is already a super mom. Super mom. Vielleicht ja auch durch den Unfall, wer weiß. Good morning, Max. Ah, oh, you and Chloe are so much quieter now than when you were kids. I remember. It's nice waking up in your house again. Oh, William and I love it. Finally seeing you and Chloe together after all these years. After the accident. I have to tell you how much I love seeing you and William together again. He's been such a hero through all this. Chloe and I, lucky to have him. Das ist ja scheint dann richtig eigentlich perfekte Familie zu sein. Eigentlich zu perfekt. Ich glaube nicht, dass es so etwas in echt gibt. Is William still the same? After everything that's happened for better and for worse but always for the better i i never thought i'd love a man so much i can't imagine life without him it sounds corny i know you rule joyce Shit. things would be different if i did i like how you think kid how are you doing joyce i'm doing the best i can max i won't lie it's difficult but Nobody said life was easy here in Arcadia Bay. Plus, you guys have to work too. Ah, uh, Bill and I have no time for ourselves. We're working more than we're living. I even had to take a part-time gig at Pan Estates. Ugh. Do you know the Prescotts? I know that Sean Prescott won't be happy until he owns everything in Arcadia Bay. Stay away from his son, Nathan. Mit dem wir uns doch eigentlich so gut verstehen, wie wir so die Nachrichten auf dem Handy gesehen haben. Do you know somebody named David Madsen? 
you and Mike hang out at the two wheels. Well, that was random. Yeah, he's a, a bus driver. He comes in sometimes. Cute, quiet. Why? Oh, um, I, w I was just curious. You always were. Nice to see that everything doesn't change. Also, uh, David scheint wirklich nur der Busfahrer hier zu sein. So, what do you think is going on here with all of this eco havoc? Maybe Arcadia Bay just wants to be left alone. I know the feeling. Honestly, I don't give a shit about too much outside our house. I don't blame you, Joyce. Except now we have dead birds and beach whales outside our front door. So maybe I should care, for Chloe's sake. I wish I was a better friend. I know Chloe doesn't get many visitors. Oh, Max, you're Chloe's best friend for a reason. You're here exactly when she needs you. I hope so. You guys do such an amazing job taking care of her. We can only do so much, and she gets damn sick of her parents. <laughs> That's why it's so important you came to spend time with her. Max, Chloe's condition is not improving. Her respiratory system is very weak and she, she, do you know what I'm saying? <sighs> Choice. I'm so sorry you have to go through all this. Bad or good, I embrace every moment with my daughter and my husband. This is what it means to be a family and we'll always be one, no matter what. I better get back to Chloe now. It's good talking with you, Joyce. You too, honey. Es wird schlechter mit Chloes Zustand oder es wird es es wird nicht in touch with her friends. Es wird nicht schlechter, aber es improved, also es wird auch nicht besser. Und ich glaube mal, Joyce hat so ein bisschen Angst, diese Ungewissheit, ob und wie lange Chloe es vielleicht noch macht. Kann man mal Licht anschalten. Dankeschön. So, Dusche, das kennen wir hier alles ja, hier waren wir auch schon mal. It's cool that Chloe uses natural medicine too. Okay. Nothing here. Auch nicht. Na, wo ist denn das Zeug? The bathroom looks almost the same. Just more medicine. Hier drüben vielleicht. Here it is. Uh, sieht doch gut aus. I never thought I'd be delivering morphine to my best friend. How's it going, Time Tripper? Funny. I think I look older. Meinst du? Ah. Liegt vielleicht an der Kleidung. So. Äh. Stimmt, hier ist doch eigentlich Chloe's Zimmer. Was ist hier jetzt so drin? Nix. Sieht das schon ein bisschen komisch, dass hier alles leer ist. A blue butterfly? I'm sure this is a total coincidence. Schrank, wo wir uns damals drin versteckt haben. At least we never had to hide from step douche. I guess we stopped growing up together. Ihre Größenanzahl, also ihre Höhe, wie sie gewachsen ist. Wir sind jetzt so groß wie Chloe. Am 2. Dezember 2005. Und spielt das hier nicht 2013? Also Chloe war vor 8 Jahren so groß wie wir jetzt sind, okay? Ein Brief. I never heard much about Williams brother. Okay, William, William hat einen Bruder. Hab ich da was verpasst, oder? Hi Bill. Sorry for not study not staying in touch since the accident. Work has been pilling up and I'm being sent to Salt Lake City to oversee a new parking lot. You have to go where the work is these days. I wish I could have sent you a bigger check, but you know the story. Money is nobody's favorite thing. Maybe I'll see you next spring for a visit. Kiss Chloe and Joyce for me. Ah, yeah, Cooper, du bist im Fernsehen. <laughs> Hang in there, Billy. Your brother, Aaron. Oh, Bill? Heißt doch, William. Keine Ahnung. Ah, was haben wir denn hier? Schuhe. Chloe always did love stomping around in her boots. Und hier haben wir Toys. Toys? Toys. I kinda wanna open this and see what's in here. 
Krücken. They bought crutches for Chloe, hoping she might walk again. Oh, schlappst du, wie es mit Chloe aussieht? Wird sie die wohl eher nicht gebrauchen? Too bad Joyce and William can't get any help from the Prescott Foundation. Dear Joyce, thank you for keeping me updated on Chloe's condition. I can only imagine the struggle you and Williams are going through. I am so sorry that I can't help you with a loan at this time. Like everybody else, I'm underwater with my own medical bills. Please give Chloe a hug and my best wishes. Love, Aunt Dorothy. Also die Tante kann momentan auch nicht finanziell aushelfen. Die braucht ihre Kohle selber für sich. I'm still overwhelmed by this new reality. And I feel so guilty for putting Chloe and her family through this. Ja, du kannst ja nicht ahnen, was I alles could give Chloe the choice wird. of keeping William alive, but that would be cruel. Hm. Das sind but dem I die see that they're a family again, and who am I to judge? Die Nebenwirkungen des Butterfly-Effekts. Na gut, Chloe hat Kopfschmerzen. Wollen wir sie nicht noch länger warten lassen. Ab geht's nach unten. Go downstairs. So, hier haben wir ja alles gesehen. Hier kennen wir ja jetzt alles. Gehen wir gleich durch zu Chloe. Lassen wir sie nicht noch länger warten. Kommen wir jetzt in dein Bad? Nee. Pitching. Finally. Uh, give me the blue pill. I'm sorry. I'm nosy, but not precise. Go ahead and plug it right in. It's so easy. And painless. Um, okay, but get ready to yell for your folks if I screw up. Oh, trust me. I will. Of course, my pain just keeps getting worse. But you caught me on a good day. Max, I'm so grateful that I'm even able to hang out with you. See, I'm getting mushy. I'm already high. <laughs> You're so adorable. Do you want anything else? Um, stop me if I'm being too emo. But can you grab one of the photo albums over there? I'd like to check out some old pictures of us when we were kids. Please, my diary is like emo ground zero. Plus, Max Caulfield does not pass up a photo op with Chloe Price. Ever. So, hier rüber hat sie gezeigt, ne? Genau. Schauen wir uns mal unsere alten Fotos an. Is that okay? Perfect. Oh my god, look how little we are there. We look like toys. I remember that day by the lighthouse. My dad was pissed at us. He actually tried to give us a time out. And you laughed at him. <laughs> my dad would have banished me. Whoa, awesome picture. We look so badass in our pirate gear. We should have taken over Arcadia Bay when we had the chance. There's still time for you. Oh man, there we are making pancakes. I love that shot of us. It's hard to believe my dad took that picture only five years ago. Literally seems like yesterday. I wish it was. Fünf Jahre sind aber auch eine lange Zeit. This photo. Maybe I could. Listen, Max. My respiratory system is failing, and uh, and it's only getting worse. I've heard the doctors talking about it when they thought I was zonked out. So, I know I'm just putting off the inevitable while my parents suffer along, and I will too. This isn't how I want things to end. What? What are you saying? I'm saying 
that being with you again has been so special. I just wanted to feel like when we were kids running around Arcadia Bay and everything was possible and you made me feel that way today. I want this time with you to be my last memory. Do you understand? Yes, I do. All you have to do is crank up the IV to 11. Ich muss jetzt gestehen, ich weiß jetzt gar nicht so richtig, ob was die aussehen, weil ich auf dem Handy nachgeguckt habe, was das Repository System ist. Das hat mit der mit der Atmung zu tun, dass das Sauerstoff durch den ganzen Körper gelangt und so. Und ich habe jetzt nicht aufgepasst, was es um was es hier gerade geht. Scheiße, ich habe nur so halb zugehört. I don't know. Chloe I really don't know if I can do this. I had another friend who wa wanted to end it all, and I did everything I could to try and save her life. How can I be responsible for ending yours? Sollten ihre Maschinen abstellen I mean, oder wie? There's got to be another way. Max, you were there for your friend, no matter what. Now I'm asking you to help me the same way. I want to help you, Chloe, but I, I think my help is hurting. At least you have a choice. When you want to make a decision, you can just do it. Look at me. I'm at the mercy of everybody. For once, I want to make my own choice. The most important one of my life. Please, help me, Max. Boah. Was sollen sie quasi von ihrem Leiter lösen, wenn ich das jetzt in der Zeit so richtig verstanden habe? Klar, was... Was bringt dir das so, ihr Leben weiterzuleben? Und sie leidet ja nur, hat Tag für Tag Schmerzen und alles, aber... Wir können keinen Menschen umbringen. can't it wrecks me to see you in any pain but i don't have any right to do this i'm an adult i'm giving you the right but joyce and william i already said my goodbyes to them but they won't honor my wishes you will right i, I can't kill you with an overdose max i'm dying from my illness not my dosage this accelerates the process. I'd rather go out on a wave than a rock. And I want my best friend to help me out. I am going to help you, but not like that. You have to believe me, Chloe. Nicht die Maschine abstellen, so eine uh, Überdosis. You're just bailing on me, like everybody else. Why don't you go now? You've been wanting to since you got here, right? So go and don't come back. Chloe, I am never leaving you again. Chloe wollte echt, dass wir ihr eine Überdosis geben, damit sie stirbt. Und jetzt scheint sie ein bisschen sauer auf uns zu sein, dass wir das nicht gemacht haben. Wow, 